Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain Why don't you sing along, my friend, for it's our last refrain Forever young, ever strong, ever brave Memories like this never end, no, they don't fade away So when I'm So a little like an absolute mess, look at my hair. God, I need to sort that out. Um, literally woke up about an hour ago um, and I've just been like doing bits and pieces. I've been editing the vlog for today that's going up and just sort of like sorting my life out. Um, I did just have a delivery though that I really wanted to show, share with you. So exciting, it's just like a little delivery from Juice, which are a little brand that does lots of like tech accessories and like portable chargers and bits and pieces like that and they've sent over three little um the sort of like stocking filler ideas which is so cool so they've sent over this which i love the packaging for it's the juice xl usb to apple lightning cable it's just a i think it's a two meter yeah two meter cable a longer cable is always necessary and then i've got a little portable charger which is the perfect size it's like very small sleek just the perfect size and then this which is what i've been most excited for it is the juice puck five watt power wireless charger i was so intrigued about this and they sent it i had no idea it was coming um and i've just put my phone on it in its case which i didn't think was even possible um and i've just plugged it in i don't really understand the whole concept of it like how you still like plug it in but it's a wireless charger um yeah look so it's here i think you might have to just charge this up and then you can like take this around but look how crazy i literally can't believe it it's so weird um, but they've just sent that over and I really appreciate it. So let me know if you'd want to win any of these because they're thinking about like hosting a competition with me on Instagram. So hitting the thumbs up and like commenting down below saying you'd like to win something like this. Either for yourself or like maybe to give away it to a family member or something at Christmas. It's really nice. Yeah, I need to start getting ready soon. I think I'm going to do my makeup and watch some YouTube whilst I'm doing it. Um, and get ready because it's podcast filming day. I literally cannot wait to record our first episode. Like I know I keep talking about it over the past few days, but it's just a really exciting new venture and a little stress relief whilst we're at uni, let's say, by like talking about things. So yeah, um, the first episode's up on Friday. So when you see this, it'll be up the following morning. I'm hoping to get it up for like 9 a.m., maybe even earlier, I don't know. Um, if I can get it all scheduled and stuff in time and we need to sort out and make sure that um spotify approve our like podcast and everything and we should be good so yeah let's get ready <laughs> this is for my vlog i just don't want my camera about you to die oh, okay. um <laughs> we're all together and um, we're just finding the room oh okay we're just gonna go find out a little room <laughs> so we're in the little podcast room um we've just been told what to do i'm kind of nervous these girls know what, we're, what they're doing journalism. journalism students um but yeah we just have to film it because over there hat's just gone for a nervous wee and um and we're just about to start recording that's trademarked. No, she hasn't actually trademarked. She has. obviously don't read Twitter. No, she has trademarked. No, she hasn't. She just hasn't been shutting people down. Yeah, that's... Oh my god, this is so... This is literally going on YouTube. Literally going on YouTube. Wow. Right, so we need this over here. Yeah, I feel like we're the ones being I feel like if once we... Hang on, is everybody's phone on silent? Lovely. Yeah. Is everyone ready? What's thinking? What's I thinking? So we're just... Wait, I'm sorry, but we have 1,625 profile visits. I know, that's crazy. I mean, probably like 500 of them me. <laughs> <laughs> um, all of them are actually me. <laughs> I think once we've done it today, we'll kind of get an idea of how yeah. it's going to work. We can even just talk about like how we met and why we decided to do it and just yeah. that'll take up loads of it. And just like, how's it going? Yeah. I think it's going to be fine. Yeah, exactly. I think we just need to start. I don't know what I'm going to say about myself. Like, hi, I'm Beth. And I want to say hi, I'm Lizzie. I love Prosecco. <laughs> I'm going to say... Okay. Gosh, I don't know what to do. Let's do it. Chronic back pain. <laughs> Right, the mics are on. Wait, do we need this little guy? Right, can we just do a tester? Testing, testing. One, two, three. Where's it going? My phone. I don't know what number. Hi, it's in Shirley. Right, just speak from where you are. Hello. 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 Hello
Right, yeah, that should be fine. I mean, we can see the sound waves yeah. on there anyway, so. Have you, can you hear it? Yeah. That's but we just kind of, <laughs> kind of. When you talk, Wait, that's what you do. Wait, that's what No, she's trademarked she's it. She's trademarked. No, she she's hasn't trademarked. actually trademarked it. She has. Obviously, don't read Twitter. No, she has trademarked it. No, she hasn't. She just hasn't been shutting people down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Literally going. Who's going to speak first? What should I say? Hi, guys, and welcome to the S Word podcast. Yeah, yeah, that was lovely. Yeah. That was lovely. That was amazing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> we need like every like a catchphrase to sign off with. Yeah. yeah. People like. Bye, sisters. Bye. Sister. Wait, should I take it? Keep just all saying bye. bye. Come on, my parents. Oh, oh, oh my goodness, I think just come. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's it. Really, yeah, have mm. them. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Don't worry about it. I have no shame, do I? Yeah, no, don't worry about it. Hang on. I've got Sorry, if you broke, I forgot to ask if you want to cross that one. I've got pads if you want to Oh, that'll be. Okay. So, we're finished recording. Right, so I might look a bit weird but I've been asleep for the past three hours because literally the second we finished filming the podcast, you'll probably see from the last clip, um, I came on my period. It had gone through my joggers. I was wearing light gray joggers. They'd got it, it had gone all the way through. Um, there was some quite dramatic spots. I was like, brilliant. Like I started getting mass, like really intense period pains. Like when we were like two thirds in and I was like, oh shit, here it is. And I, I just didn't even think of it like, being down there though, if you know what I mean? I was like, oh, my period's coming. Like, I usually get pains like a few days before I start, but it like happened there and then. And then I got home, my vision was like going, I I, li I literally can't stress to you enough how excruciating my periods are. I'm not saying they're worse than anyone else or anything, I'm not comparing them that way. But I know some girls are lucky enough not to have period pains at all. But like my vision went and I was try I was sitting on the toilet like trying to sort myself out and like my whole vision was going and then my head started banging and I got a migraine and I was like brilliant. <laughs> um, so I had a migraine and really intense period pains. Um, so I was like f forcing myself to try and sleep for like an, um, I think it took me about 30 minutes, 45 minutes before like my stomach and head had settled a tiny bit for me, enough for me to relax and go to sleep. Um, but I'm gonna mention these. I don't, I, for those of you that haven't watched me for a while, you might not know about these. And you might think this is really ridiculous, but I have suffered with the worst period pains my whole life. No matter what pill I go on, at least one of the days I have will be excruciating, like calm, like I almost, I threw up earlier as well. I forgot to say that I threw up from the pain. It was that bad. These pads, I got sent these, I think it was like at the beginning of second year. And I was thinking, right i said to the brand i was like i'll test them because i literally will take anything to try and test them because my periods are so bad so that like, i'll test them but i'll only mention them if they work or whatever expecting like the, how are these tiny little plasters gonna do anything and i put one on when i i was like i'm gonna use these when i have really bad pains and just see what happens and it says on the front it's like soothe period cramps the natural way natural ingredients fa fast acting up to 12 hours release relief sorry um and you see I, I, as soon as i unsealed it i could smell like really strong menthol it's like a really minty smell and you literally just stick it on it's like a plaster so as you can see here sorry about the weird angle um you can see it's just a little plaster that i've just popped on my lower stomach and within 15 minutes my whole period pain's gone and it does say it lasts up to 12 hours and i mean i haven't had any um pain since and it's been three four hours later um and I've worn these and I've been using them since. Like, I've been buying them because they work so well for me. And I can't stress, I just can't believe it. Like, I don't know how it works. And the people that I know that have used these, it's worked for them as well. So maybe if you're someone like me who suffers and hasn't found anything yet, you could give these a go. I'm not saying that it's going to work for everyone. But, like, I have, I literally was so cynical. I was like, how the fuck are these going to work? And they've not. They've not disappointed ever since I started, so I'll be continuing to buy these until they stop working, which I don't think will happen anytime soon. I just really don't get it. 
literally 15 20 minutes and my period pains are gone like period pains that were making me sick making my vision go giving me a migraine the migraine stayed to be fair for a while but obviously the plaster is not going to help this little plaster pad is not going to help my migraine and um, yeah so i've been asleep for three hours i've got shitty ratchet hair again sorry about that um but yeah the podcast recording went super well earlier we were a bit nervous and like I don't know, a bit anxious when we first started. You can tell that we were a bit like, oh God. But the episode will be live, I think at 9 a.m. Friday on Spotify if you want to listen to it, um, like whilst you're out and about. And if you want to see the all, um, the visual version of it, it's going to be on my YouTube channel, Charlotte Emily, on my main one. Um, so yeah, that's all good. And it all went really smoothly, to be honest. Um, we were just like sort of overthinking at the beginning. So you can tell we're a little bit nervous and like not sure what to say hopefully you enjoy it let me know if you do um, i'm assuming people are watching this before but some people might watch this vlog afterwards um but yeah let me know your thoughts i'm gonna go make some pasta because i'm starving <laughs> i've just finished watching i'm a celeb i made some pasta whilst i was talking to my mum on facetime just been watching i'm a celeb let me know who your favorite i love and um, caitlin and roman they're my favourites on I'm a Celeb so far. I do really like um, James as well. But yeah, I'm really enjoying it. I always love I'm a Celeb. It like takes my mind off uni every year. Like it's so weird. We were set, like talking earlier about um, watching it because obviously we've watched it all together over the past few years at uni and like it's just so crazy how quick time's gone. It makes me realise how quick time is going and like I don't know, it's really strange. So yeah, I've been watching that, um, which has given us a little stress relief in the evenings. I've finished editing the podcast episode for Friday, which is fab. I literally cannot wait for it to go live and hopefully get a good response. Like, I'm really nervous that people are not going to like it, but hopefully he will give us a chance because obviously it was our first episode and we were nervous. Um, but yeah, I'm just sort of sorting my stuff out um, together for tomorrow because Thursdays are my days that I spend with Carrie. But I have got three hours of lectures in the middle of the day, so I'm sorting out... Um, what I need to prepare for my lectures and also stuff that I need to go and shoot with Carrie because I've got some brand stuff that I need to shoot for my Instagram. Um, so yeah, lots of bits and pieces to do. Yeah, and I think we're going to go to Thor's to shoot some of, the, some of the content and also just enjoy ourselves because Thor's is the best. Like, if you watch my vlog from last week, me and Hattie went there for the first time this year and the hot chocolate is just unreal. It's £2.50, you get this huge cup of hot chocolate and it's like got this such a unique taste that just reminds me of Thor's every year. So I'm really excited for me and Carrie to go there and get some cute photos and have a just nice time relaxing and getting all Christmassy and festive. Let me know how your week is going and what you've been up to, what's going on. Like I said, I've been going through a lot of shit behind the scenes, but I'm trying to like stay positive and on top of things so that I don't really struggle on everything. But I hope you guys are doing okay. I know this time of the year is very difficult. Yeah, I know this time of the year there is a lot of pressure about being happy because it's like Christmas and I always feel very stressed that I'm never happy at this time of year because of uni and like all my assignments are like doing around doing around the same time or I've got so much work to do over Christmas I've got like three things go going on as well as like then I'm gonna have to revise for my exam and blah blah it's just a lot a lot to take in yeah I hope everyone else is coping okay make sure to reach out to your loved ones if you are feeling okay as well make sure everyone else in your family friendship group is okay because it's nice to check up on people and also take time for loving yourself and caring for yourself doing what's right for you thank you very much for watching this vlog i hope you're having a great week being productive and also giving and also taking time to chill out my boyfriend's coming tomorrow which i'm so excited for because i haven't feel like i haven't seen him in ages uh, I think the last time I saw him was early November, so it's like not even been a month. But yeah, I just am really excited to see him because lots of stuff has happened since we last saw each other and obviously we've caught up, but yeah, it's just like, it'll just be nice to like have a cuddle. <laughs> so cringe, but it'll be just nice to have a cuddle and have a nice little time together. Should be really lovely and we've got a few things planned actually whilst Aiden's here, so that'll be really fun to vlog and share with you. And um, what we get up to. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye.